What's up, Sagittarius? This is Soul. And Sagittarius, this is going to be your bi-weekly messages beginning um, April 22nd and ending May 5th, 2019. The messages will be for Sagittarius Sun, Sagittarius Moon, and Sagittarius Rising as well. All right, Sagittarius. Yes, it's Easter Sunday morning for me. I am committed in getting these videos out before the, the due date. You know, I don't care if it's, well, I do care that it's Easter and happy Easter to you all. Um, I hope you have a, a nice, enjoyable Easter. Anyway, uh, showing my face again to connect with my viewers and my uh, subscribers, my audience, um, and for the newcomers to um, who come to the channel and want to um, see what the face looks like uh, behind the voice. So, yeah, I'm just... Show my face again. Also, to uh, Sagittarius, if you have an opportunity, one of the predictions that I have made in Virgo, general love reading uh, has come to pass already, <laughs> sooner than I thought it would. Uh, so if you have an opportunity, it's not mandatory to, but I wanted to share that on, uh, uh, pass this on to you, that uh, one of the predictions I have made. Now, it wasn't based on Virgo. It was something that came out of the blue at the, you know, as I was wrapping up their video. And uh, I was hearing from spirit, and I, I think it was, I know it was my spirit guide, Aaron. I know it, because he says, <laughs> he whispered in my ear, he said, just make mention of this. And so what uh, what took place was that uh, they had uh, a card combination, the three of swords uh, upright over top of the um, star card. So the star card is always about um, not only psychic abilities, psychic energies, but it's also um, relates to people who are famous, world famous. And <clears throat> for me, it's social networking. So anyway, I picked up that there was someone uh, through the message that I was receiving um, that someone very well known that we were know uh, was going to either uh, separate or divorce in the month of May. I did mention May, but because of uh, the energies, the timing is uh, always going to be, you know, a factor because of the fact that we can't do that. We can't just say, okay, you know, April 21st, uh, so-and-so is going to happen. We can't do that. We can't set a time, but they give us the energy. And so when it does take place or something that they... Uh, give us in terms of presentations of images or you know uh, yes i actually do hear whispers and the voices so and i'm not crazy or paranoid so don't get it twisted but anyway um sagittarius just wanted to share that with you uh yes it was adele the singer um separating from her husband simon and a couple other things that uh i had discovered as i googled her because i don't watch the news and I just happened to go online and, you know, my web page, uh, MSN, opened up. And that was the very first thing that I seen. Adele and her husband, Simon, are separating after two years. And I'm like, wow. Okay. So I thank Spirit, Aaron, <laughs> for giving me that message. And the reason why he did that was he said, because we want you to know that you are connecting with us and the way that you would know is if we send you a validation and so that was the validation so but there's um still the potential of someone else because i you know i said may so we'll see anyway using my uh deck the afro goddess uh tarot deck once again to perform these uh messages for you sagittarius uh, see what's coming up for you. Also, um, the shadow card energy, the last card at the bottom of the card or card at the bottom of the deck um, may play out along with the rest of the energies that I select for you. And if it's a major arcana, uh, Sagittarius, it may carry more weight. All right, so let's get right into it without further ado. So, what's coming up for my fellow Sages for the next two-week period of time? All right, what's coming up for Sag? What's in store for Sagittarius? All right, 
here we go. So, you know, um, Sagittarius, when I have my personal readings, I always tell my clients, I don't change nothing that I say. <laughs> I really don't. And anyone who has had a reading with me, they could attest to you the fact that I don't change nothing because it's not meant for me to do that because it's what I'm hearing, what I'm seeing, what I'm feeling, and I have to go with what I, I get. These are general readings, but I also pick up these vibes when I'm doing general readings, just like I did with the... Um, you know, uh, Virgo video when I felt that, you know, someone was going to um, be divorcing or separating and it was going to be someone very well known and popular. And I did mention a singer or it could be uh, an actor, somebody in the professional realm, but very uh, popular. Now, isn't this interesting? So I always like to see the energy that shows up for the sign that I'm reading for. This is you. This is the king of wands. So this is a uh, Starting off already, now depending on what else is going to be revealed for you Sagittarius, at least you start off with um, some passion. Um, Often, wow, look at that, the Two of Cups is going to be your overall energy for the uh, two-week period of time. <laughs> so the God of Wands, King of uh, Wands, could represent female uh, energies in terms of flexibility, Um uh, but it's representing your energy and the energy of the other fire signs, Aries and Leo. So some things could be intense. Some things could be very passionate. This could be uh, someone, um, you know, this is sexual expression, sexual energy. The king is focused. He or she is focused on something or someone or something. But this is good in the upright position. So let's just see how things uh, continue to unfold for you. Well, it's starting off pretty good with the Two of Cups. So relationships come to, come to the forefront or the relationships will be the focus for some of you during the two-week period of time. That Two of Cups could mean... Uh, a development of a new romantic partnership or it could be a friendship it could be something going on with children that's the card of invitations going out to dinners uh, being on the same page and um, seeing eye to eye with one another because it is in the upright position um, mutual mutual exchange of feelings or respect for one another okay Two of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, male or female, comes into uh, play with this energy. So you may or may not be dealing with any uh, water signs, but that's what's showing up. Could be involvement with, you know, children, because Cups represent children for me. So we have the Shadow Card energy, the King of Wands. And then now we have the Two of Cups as the overall energy. What follows? That two of cups is the will of fortune. <laughs> luck is on your side. Good luck and good fortune. Now, the good luck and good fortune could open up in all areas. And it's not just because it is the will of fortune, you know, strictly related to money or finances or taking a gamble. Although you could. But I always say when the will of fortune shows up uh, for these general readings, don't, you know, if you're a gambler, gamble responsibly don't take large sums of money and, and drop it on the power ball and think that you're going to uh, end up winning no no uh chances are very very slim so but it can be applied to almost all other areas uh, of your life where there's some sort of good luck and good fortune that may show up and that's always good follows the two of cups so that could be good luck someone gets fortunate in meeting someone new romantically platonically okay 
Interesting. Wheel of Fortune. Now, the wheel continuously turns, so, you know, you don't have all this good luck and good fortune that's going to stay with you. It may be just for the two-week period of time, so take advantage of it. Or not necessarily take advantage of it, but if it occurs, it may not go beyond the two-week period of time. So I feel that it's very good uh, and auspicious energy so far showing up. Now, we have another court card. This is the, the god of swords this is the king of swords now he's in the reverse so just to show you what the god of swords looks like or the king of swords so there's a decision to be made okay so now this could be um with you maybe something crops up 